Prince Harry and Meghan Markle suffered a mid-air scare after their private jet was struck by lightning, it has been reported. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex had been traveling to Amsterdam for a star-studded three-day party on September 21. According to the Mail on Sunday, a lightning bolt hit the luxury Dassault Falcon 7X aircraft's nose cone, narrowly missing its radar and navigation equipment by mere inches. The bolt sent at least 30 million volts surging through the fuselage, but luckily the plane was able to land safely at Schiphol Airport in the Netherlands. Once grounded, it is believed the aircraft then underwent vigorous safety checks and repairs for a week. Planes can be struck by lightning fairly frequently, with the average commercial aircraft being hit about once a year. Fortunately they are built to conduct electricity around their shell without letting it in, meaning they can mostly handle bolts. However, lightning has been known to bring down planes on the rare occasion, with an US aircraft crashing in 1963 after the fuel tank ignited. Prince Harry and Meghan flew to Amsterdam to attend Soho House founder Nick House's 55th birthday party and celebrate the opening of the newest branch of the members club chain. Other celebrity guests included Michael McIntyre, Jenna Coleman, Nick Grimshaw and Eddie Redmayne. It is thought the Duke and Duchess flew from London Oxford Airport, just over 10 miles from their home in the Cotswolds. The royal couple have signed a two-year lease on a private cottage in Great 2, Oxfordshire, in close proximity to Soho Farmhouse, which is also part of the Soho House Group. During their weekend in Amsterdam, they were frequently spotted with Marcus Anderson, consultant to Soho House and a close friend of the former Suits actress. The 37-year-old was rumored to have been the potential matchmaker for the couple and is said to have organized private rooms for them in different Soho House branches during their courtship.